Hello, good evening. Yes, as you can see, long time ago, somebody, a good friend, or my client, I used to do hair, her hair in a shop at Supercut. She knows that I'm making jewel, but just a simple jewel, like a basic, different kind of bead, just put it in a nylon string and do this and do that. But I make money out of that. Just simple. Then she gave me this, she gave me this pendant, okay? And those are the pendant I give, she gave me, and she gave me this too. That was a long time ago. I just find out when I'm digging my stuff and I found this and I said, oh, oh, okay. So, before, I don't know what to do with this pendant, right? LOL. But now I do know because up before my retirement, I went to Michael's to get some class like classes like how do you hook this what kind of different gates wire you know what kind of tools and stuff i want to learn those things before i make a real jewelry that i can make an extra income so there there it is i got i got the pendant different style as you can see over here and I'm just gonna use this to make, to close it up, see? I got the pendant, now I know what to do with the pendant. Put the, put the chains and make a binding to close it up. So these are what I did today. The panda that he gave, she gave me, okay? That's what I've been doing all day to make sure I hook it right that I learned from Michael's Arts and Crop. And this one here, I'm going to make earrings, okay? I can make two earrings, three pairs of earrings. He gave me that too. All right, or maybe three pend pendants together that I can use this chain. But right now, this one right here, I'm going to make my own pendants, okay? There you go. I make the frame to the jig okay and i make the frame like this and i'm going to the the wire is 16 gauge and i'm gonna put that there and this one with uh i believe 24 gauge or the tennis one that i can binding or wrap it with this uh with this uh what do you call that beads to make a pendant okay that's what i'm going to do this evening so i'm gonna be busy again so there's all the pendants i'm going to make today and maybe tomorrow. So you have a wonderful night and good night. Have a blessed night. Bye-bye now. See you next video. Good evening. It's almost midnight. And welcome back to my channel, Darren Workshop. So the last time I show you is I'm going to make my own uh, 
I'm sorry. Oh, I'm going to make my own. Well, I fall asleep then. Right there. Um, pendants. My goodness. So I'm wrapping. I'm just trying to finish wrapping. Okay. Wrap. This is 24 gauge. When you wrap things, 24 gauge is good for wrapping. It just kinky, kink, kink a lot. So you gotta watch out. So you just make it straighten up all the time. And so far this is what I got. Right there, okay. This is a lot of wrapping. 24 gauge. And the frame is 16 gauge. There you go. I'm just gonna cut this. It's the first time I made this. This kind of pendant. First time I made this kind of pendant. Oh, sorry. Uh, okay. Not sharp. Not sharp going on. So I'm just going to finish this. It's almost, no, it's 11 something. My bedtime is 12 o'clock or more, lol. But can you see what I'm doing? I'm just gonna wrap that around and I'm gonna wrap this all like that, okay? To make secure, I'm gonna go through after I finish this, I'm gonna go through in the back and secure more that beads. Okay, I'm just showing you how I did it. Not uh, demonstrate or showing or telling. There you go. Just like that, see? This I did it in purpose, spray it out a little bit, okay? That's my style. That way it look natural, not machine, machineries. Oh my goodness, those movies get, get scary all the time. You got no time for that, sorry. Have to change the channels. I mean, I don't mind watching spooky daytime, not in a, almost midnight, LOL. Ooh. Did you see what I'm doing? I'm standing up. I used to be standing up on my feet for almost 25 years as a hairstylist. Cut, cut, cut hair, color, color hair, style hair, coloring iron, flat iron. Oh my goodness. On my feet for almost more than eight hours. 
a day. Okay. There we go. So I'm just going to go and stop right here. I'm just showing you what's going on, okay? There you go. That's my style. And I'll see you tomorrow. Have a sweet dream, wonderful dream. Good night. Good morning again. Ta -da! So this is what I did. Making this necklace. And this is my necklace. I made that pendant to wear every day. And this is going to do in the market. Okay. Thank you. Good morning. Today is Friday morning, and this is it. Ta -da! This is what I made for my pendant. See, I just wrap it up and I don't have to cut wires when it's enough because I just gonna go in down here and just tie it up really good so that it won't fall fall down. And I put this one right here. I hope it fit my neck. Okay, this is the finding I I use a lobster clubs whatever they call a lobster. The only lobster I know is the lobster I eat, LOL. My voice sounds like a man in early in the morning. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna put that today. My everyday necklace to wear. Ta-da! There we go. This is what I like. You know, almost fit right there. Not too, too long. This is right I want. I double the cord, okay? So, there you go. Keep messing this up like that, so I have to turn that um, loop to make it like that. Okay, thank you for watching. Good morning. You have a blessed day. Bye-bye now for now. See you in the next video. Bye. Good morning again. Ta -da! So this is what I did making this necklace. And this is my necklace. I made that pendant to wear every day. And this is going to do in the market. Okay. Thank you. I'm going to put that in here. So welcome to Darling Workshop. And thank you for watching. And welcome. So how are you this morning? I'm fine.
So this necklace, except for this, is mine to wear every day, daily. I like big pendants, so this one is going to the market. So, if you have a hobbies like arts and crafts and making jewelry, you search, get a knowledge about it, because everything nowadays is knowledge. And then you, and then you educate yourself, okay? Very important is to search knowledge, educate yourself. And then, because those three steps, or how many steps, search, knowledge, educate yourself, okay? And because those three steps is uh, extra income for you, okay? As soon as you put it in the market, sell it to your friend, your children's friend, you know, neighbors. You do anything, good thing to do in life, okay? So I'm retired, so I can do this. I'm retired of cosmetology, beauty from head to toe. And I, I do instructors. Of, uh, in the beauty academy also. So I took them all the knowledge. Then I create things. I got hair color and especially blow dryer, curling iron hairstyle. And then this one here. So I have those knowledge. And I can tutorial, tutorial, for this making jewelry, but I want in person, mano a mano, that way I show them personally and they can feel what it's all about. That's the way I want. There we go. So I got five necklaces to put in the market. Before Christmas, I have to do a lot of this too. For gift, for gift giving to others, because giving is caring and caring is giving. That's equals love. I see you again next time. So I'm just telling you this all goes to the market today. There I go. And then they say, thank you for supporting my jewelry. So uh, I've been making jewelry before. I just updated how to be a jewelry maker. Okay. I got a book to read and study. Those are theories that I got to know and learn. There you go. So, one, two, three, four. By blessing that I made to my extra income. Okay, there you go. And then I will wear this daily. LOL. Okay. 
And thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. You have a blessed day. Bye-bye now.